gentleman and you couldn't find a worthier guest of honour. You can see how well the players are responding to having a former player themselves. As I think we're going to see Cantona today and Giggs, and I think with the blend of skill that they've got on both sides, I think, honestly, we're in for a classic today. He's also provided the big team surprise, 19-year-old Graham Fenton only took such power through their midfield. I've got a feeling that'll be the crucial battle between Paul Ince and Roy Keane. Oh, Hughes, playing it around. McGrath, back to Bosnich. McGrath, that was a nifty one. Just in towards Giggs. It's... Driving forward again. Hughes, Hughes! A little dummy. And in the end, Richard. That's the Coca Cola Cup. And as I say, it'll be that for another three years. Let's look at that. And the ball into Hughes. And it's or two. Another great ball in here from Cantona, and it's into his feet, but unfortunately it goes through his legs. But he just uses it. Pallister helping it on, up towards Hughes. Cantona, a touch. was being well watched by Pallister in any case. McGrath gets it away. The difference at the moment between the two sides is they've got Saunders up front, who's not a natural sort of boot. It's perfect, it is keen. Hughes, will Keen be there to finish it off? Diving in, pushed away. Meant before that Saunders can't really get hold of that boy, he can only flick it on, but there's no one else there. Keen. Working. They find themselves up against the wall a little bit. Ferguson thought he may. And uh, he's certainly got the pace to cause them problems, and there's not many players in the league have got that sort of pace to, to cause Man United. Race by Barrett. Took the difficult route, was out. And Richardson and the young lad. Kapchowskis. Cantona just flicking it in with a little bit of task these days, the linesman, because when you see replays, you sometimes approve right, sometimes approve wrong. The one thing that certainly improves how difficult a job it is. Atkinson. When the squad teams were announced today. Free kick to Manchester United. Let's get that one away. And then find Cantona. Long from one side. It's with a header. Hughes. That's it right. He could get another goal here today. In the meantime, it's Villa. Well, he's been effective at both ends so far this afternoon, but he uh, took too much on there. But it's with. I think is, is the most lively player sometimes. But today, I think he's been sharp from the first minute on. And I just. Hendon, 77,231. Up goes McGrath. Former Manchester United player, with distinction as well, Big Paul. 153 league games he played for United, he was... Who's playing it in? Hughes, looking to get something on the turn. Also, Canton is waiting in the middle, and there was just a deflection off Paul McGraw. Up towards Daly, Parker cuts it out. McGraw with a header for Villa. And of course, Manchester United back here in a fortnight's time. Pallister with a header. McGraw with one in return. Keane, some good play here. Roy Keane, will he go all the way? Ince goes down. Anyway. Might be Giggs, possibly, is coming off. McGraw with the headers. Kanchowskis, Ince. Cantona stopped by McGraw's Chalker. Kanchowskis again on the far side, crossed in there towards it. He let it go, Hughes! Shot was charged down. Cantona looks to get a header in. Irwin plays it in again. And Villa lining up to get that one. Look at the moment they're making the most of it. But now they have some worrying to do as Cantona finds Kanchowskis. 
And McGrath again is there, just where he needed to be. Yeah, great, great block there. He injured himself at the same time. Cantona with the cross. Oh, Bosnich and McGrath both coming and having words with him. He didn't get the other one and got a knock, because he's come at such a pace here, he's got absolutely no margin for error. And I don't think he can do anything else but head it away. Offside, yes, it was a uh, There's nothing better, there's nothing more exciting. Cantona, there's a chance here! Oh, and it's got... They haven't, they've just played the normal way. But Villa, this is a big step up from the last three league games, that's for sure. Kanchelskis on the far side, will he keep that in play? He has, he's knocked it back in again towards Cantona! Ince is getting in there too, looking to chip it back there. And in the end... This little clip, you see a great ball he gets in under... Under duress, really, and it's taken by, I think, in the end, Ince. Ince who turns. Alex Ferguson, knowing that there's a real sizable job to be done by his team now, with a little over. D sharp. And McGrath stabbing it away. Irwin playing it in again. Ten minutes of the game left now. McGrath. What an afternoon it'll be for Paul McGrath. After all those seasons at Manchester United, they let him go, Villa snapped him up. Actually, it was Ron Atkinson who brought him over about 12 years ago from Ireland. It cost £25,000 when he took him to uh, Manchester United. And he's been fantastic again tonight, Kevin, uh, today. Yeah, he's just been uh, rock-solid rock in the back of the defence there. Him and Teal, to be fair, yeah. inspirational for them. Irwin curling this one in, Bosnich going for it, gets a fist to it, knocked back by... Mark Hughes! So Villa 2, Manchester United 1. Mark Hughes run here. Oh, and the space now for Paul Ince to drive one in, but two men absolutely... Alistair hitting it in again. Panton are in there too. Uh, half an hour. Extra time, of course, if United can uh, notch another one here. Hughes! Oh, a fantastic save by Bosnich! Watch this again, Brian. This is a terrific knockdown by, I think, Cantona. Set up, and he hits it so well. And look at that for a save. World class. Two minutes left. Curled in. Keane will... The final whistle's gone. It's Aston Villa who've won it. And the treble is no more. The possibility has gone out of the window here at uh, Wembley tonight. Well, it, they played the part in a terrific game. I, I know that'll only be a scant consolation to them. But wasn't it played in the right spirit? It was a terrific game. We've had a player sent off. There's not been a bad tackle in the game. Possibly just one half a bad one. A fantastic yeah. triumph for him. Yeah, I think he's, he, he comes out of it with the sort of credit he deserves.